Congratulations through to the uh, semi-finals. Can you just tell me through your day's racing? Yeah, it's uh, been a long day as a result of the uh, having to do two runs. Um, the first run I was just a little bit off in so many places, and I think any one of those little errors that weren't, you know, if they weren't in, then you know I could have been into the the semi-final after the first run, but. Uh, Second run, yeah, of course there was a lot of pressure on that run to deliver because that would, that would be it all over if I didn't manage it and uh, yeah, I just had to pick my way down it, uh, you know, aiming to, to do a few things much better and, and keep to some plan, the same plan on the, most of it. What did you learn from the first run that you took there into the second? Uh, yeah, the learnings for the first run were yeah, that I, you know, there's a couple of places just before the bridge, uh, gates 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I was a wee bit unstuck there in the first run and took a lot of time and managed to tighten that up a little bit for the second run. And mainly that was the, the uh, key area because the first run there, that also ran into the move that's just after the bridge, the upstream on the right to down. Um, and I, I came unstuck there in the first run too and managed to keep that boat speed running and, and get a better line there too. Great, and what are you going to do is make sure you're ready for Saturday now. Uh, so yeah, to get ready for Saturday now, I definitely will be going back and doing absolutely nothing, probably falling asleep in my bed or something. Uh, it's been a pretty tough day mentally and uh, yeah, tomorrow I'll just go for a little bit of a cruise in the boat to keep myself moving, keep the old body moving and then uh, yeah, get ready for, for Saturday.